Welcome back to The Restaurant Show. With me now is Matt Betchart from Granite City Food and Brewery. Matt, how are you? I'm doing great, thanks. How are you doing? I'm doing better now that you're here, <laughs> so I want to make sure that I say this right. We're making pork tenderloin scallopini with a balsamic beurblanc sauce. That's correct, yes. So how do we do that? Let's get well, started. Uh, pretty simple uh, start here. We've got our nice pork tenderloin. Okay. Um, it's a little um, pork tenderloin that has been just pounded out sure. um, very nicely. Okay. I'm going to uh, start off actually uh, with some uh, oil in a pan. We're mm -hmm. going to get that nice and hot so we get a real good sear okay. on our um, pork. And then um, the pork, as you can see, is uh, nicely pounded out. It's unseasoned at this point, but okay. I have seasoned flour. So I oh, put okay. some salt and pepper into our flour here and um, we're just gonna dredge it. Okay, um, salt and pepper, that's all it takes. Yeah, that's it. That's awesome. Um, you okay. know, real simple, uh, just give a little nice seasoning on there. Okay, And uh, I'm gonna keep uh, just dredging these up here and then we'll... Uh, and then you just um, throw them in the pan. Get them going in that nice okay. hot pan. Okay, cool, cool. Here. And uh, you also have uh, mushroom risotto and uh, aborio rice. Tell us a little bit about those things. Well, yeah, risotto mm -hmm. um, is uh, classically made with aborio rice, which okay. is a little different um, rice than people are probably most familiar with, sure. which is that um, long grain white rice. Okay. Um, aborio rice is actually a short grain okay. um, Italian rice, and it does actually have Make sure my heat's all the way on there. There you go. <laughs> um, it does actually have a little more starch content um, than okay. your classic rice. Um, so that's kind of nice. It actually adds a, a little bit of a, a creamy texture to um, to this uh, risotto dish here. Okay. And um, of course, the, the risotto that we have today is mm -hmm. a mushroom risotto. Okay. And um, that we actually, um, we add uh, dried porcini mushrooms that have been ground Ooh, up, right. and then uh, also uh, shiitake mushrooms. Okay, great. So that's kind of neat there. That um, tastes good. Some really nice, rich mushroom flavor, if yeah. you will. And yeah. uh, that'll complement um, this dish quite nicely. Excellent, excellent. And I think it's interesting to note that the beurre blanc is actually French for white butter. Yes, beurre and blanc, so uh, yeah. we got a white butter and then we're gonna add the balsamic to that. Um, this sauce actually is really quite simple. Um, it's gonna be uh, sauteed shallots. Okay. Um, we add some white wine to it, reduce it down, which is gonna just concentrate that white wine flavor. Sure. And uh, then we're gonna finish it off um, with butter and just a touch of cream for it too. Oh, okay. Um, that sounds pretty good. Yes. Yeah, so you got some broccolini here, I see, as well. That's correct, that's correct. And uh, in fact, I'm gonna get that broccolini started in a, okay. in a pan here. We've Sounds good. Some, uh, and and tell us butter. about the beer that you brought with you today. Well, we bought, <clears throat> brought our um, Mr. Corporate is the name of the beer. Mr. It's, Corporate. It is a uh, Schwartz beer, okay. which is uh, German for black lager. Okay. Um, so classically, you think of lager as a, kind of a lighter, crisp, yeah. clean, and mild. And pretty much what we do to this beer is we are going to toast those ro and roast the barley and the malts. Okay. Um, and that's going to give it that nice dark color. Yeah. And then we'll add a little sweetness as we toast it. Okay. And um, uh, and then you know again it's going to have a little bit of uh, bittersweet flavor. Sure. And so that'll go real nice with our uh, sort of pork tenderloin. Dish okay. Here. Awesome. Awesome. Um, you know I noticed that it's, it's almost uh, two references to uh, the Spaceballs movie. You have Schwartz beer, <laughs> and it's Mr. Corporate. You remember the part where they were saying Mr. Coffee and Mr. Radar? Yep, yep, I got you. You, so you picked up on that, yeah. huh? Yeah, <laughs> I like that. <laughs> that is good. Okay, that is good. so the broccolini is cooking here? Yeah, and we're just gonna lightly saute it. I actually um, blanched it um, at the restaurant, so okay. it's, it's got it's brought out its real nice bright color, green, and, uh, and then we're just gonna saute it light, lightly in, um, in uh, some garlic butter. Okay. Um, so. So uh, what do you guys have coming up for Christmas? You guys got some gift card specials. Yeah, yeah. one of the things we're really promoting is gift cards. You know, it's a great way to uh, give a nice present. And uh, for every $25, you get a $5 bonus card. So if okay. you're looking to give somebody a nice present, they can come into Granite City, enjoy okay. a great meal. Um, and then you can have a little bonus card back yourself. So you kind of get uh, buy a present for someone, get a little present for yourself. Oh, nice. And uh, so that's a real great promotion. Every $25, like I said, you get a $5 bonus card. OK, is that $25 in gift cards? That's correct. Okay. Yep. $25 in gift cards gets you a free $5 bonus card. All right. All right. So we're just going to get that plated I love there the quickly. the dark green color of that. That is so cool. And I'm really going to get started on this uh, mushroom risotto here. Okay. And we've uh, partially cooked this again at the restaurant. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm going to add some uh, chicken stock here to it. Okay. Um, I'm sorry, vegetable stock. Vegetable actually. stock. You got it. And uh, what that's going to do is going to absorb into the rice. Mm -hmm. And then um, once we get that nicely 
absorbed into, and you'll see the liquid will just start to uh, yeah. go in there, and then we'll add uh, some butter and some Parmesan cheese to finish it. Okay. So our pork here is fully cooked, and uh, at this point, we're going to add that butter sauce that I mentioned. Right. And um, with this sauce, again, this is something that we made ahead of time. It's mm -hmm. just very important that it doesn't break because it's very um, rich sauce. I'm going to okay. add also to that some um, balsamic reduction. Okay. And when you say break, and you don't want it to break, what does that mean? Uh, that means separate, actually. Okay. I guess that's uh, okay. a little uh, restaurant lingo That's a little there. restaurant lingo. I'm yeah. learning. I'm yeah. learning. Okay. So we'll just um, so you had, uh, all I mean, nicely coated. We were talking here. a little bit before the show started that you had a, a great turnout for your Thanksgiving. Yeah. Hey, we had a lot of people really uh, enjoy themselves. And again, people came from um, a lot of different areas, brought their families, and um, really enjoyed um, Thanksgiving. So good. Good. That's really, good to hear. Um, and then you, are you still doing your uh, your brunch from 9 to 2 uh, every Sunday? That's right. Yep. Mm -hmm. Fantastic Sunday brunch. Uh, carved prime rib, made mm -hmm. to order omelets. We have a full brunch line as yeah. well um, where you you know you can get all your eggs and sure. bacon and biscuits and gravy. Right. Um, we always have a number of chef entrees, including yeah. different pasta specials and sure. so forth. So that's a lot of fun um, and really a great value at $16.99. Yeah. Um, I, one of the best in town there. So. Yeah. So all that... Uh, all that prime rib. Yeah, as much <laughs> as you can You can eat all do. prime rib if you want to. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to uh, finish up this uh, risotto here. Okay. And we're going to add some Parmesan cheese. Well, I'm ready with my fork already, man. <laughs> <laughs> some cold butter. And the trick to this, if I can get it out of the pan yeah. there, is uh, this is going to add that nice creamy texture um, that is associated with the risotto. And so right. I'm just going to stir this around just until the butter Incorporates in, and I'm wondering, can I pour a can I pour a beer here? Hey, while you're that would be that? fantastic. Which uh, which one? The the, one that glass the... right there would be excellent. Perfect. Perfect. We'll go right here if we can. Yeah. yeah. There you go. Gotta love that sound, right? All right. So we'll plate our risotto while you're pouring that beer. Yeah. Look at that. And I'll uh, just finish up here with the uh, pork tenderloin. Oh wow. <clears throat> I'm going to take a quick bite here because we are out of time. I can't believe it. There you cook you this go. fast, though. I mean, this is this yeah, take too much time. Yeah, it does a nice quick, quick cook dish. All right, so. so this is the pork tenderloin. We're going to try this real quick. Oh, my God. So you get a nice acidity from the, por from the, uh, from the balsamic with the rich butter sauce. Come there back anytime. Hey, always <laughs> my pleasure. This is Matt Betchart from Granite City Food and Brewery. Head on down there. It's right by the West Town Mall, and we'll be right back with more Restaurant Show after the break.